According to uh, the Dodgers, Vince Coleman threw a firecracker out of his car in Los Angeles yesterday. Eric Davis says this, the firecracker allegedly landed near some baseball fans who were looking for autographs, and three people claimed they were injured outside of Dodger Stadium. Coleman and Bobby Bonilla were riding in Eric Davis's car when Coleman threw the firecracker. There had been an explosion inside a crowd near the exit where the baseball players leave the stadium. Uh, they found that they had three injuries at that location. One was a child, a uh, one-year-old female, had a burn on her cheek and a possible minor eye injury. Uh, the other was an 11-year-old boy, and he had a trauma to his one of his legs. There was an adult female who had a hearing problem and also uh, vertigo problems. It could start fizzing, and then everybody thought it was just like a smoke bomb, and then it just blew up really big, and sparks flew everywhere. So one thing if you could for us, comment on what happened yesterday. I'm not commenting on that. That's always right now for them. Okay, the Associated Press is... I'm not commenting on that. Okay? Do you understand what that means? Okay, you have nothing? No. No comment means no comment. I don't have anything to say on the issue. Right now, what we have is an ongoing investigation by the arson section of the Los Angeles City Fire Department. Vince Coleman was in the Mets lineup today, but he refused to comment about the incident after the game. The Mets beat the Dodgers this afternoon, 4 to nothing, behind Eric Hillman's pitching. Mets got their first run in the fifth inning. Joe Orsalak took a Ramon Martinez pitch deep to right center field. It went out. Orsalak's fifth homer of the year put the Mets up by a score of 1 to nothing. In the seventh inning, Eric Hillman was in a jam. Two runners on, but he got out of it, striking out Corey Snyder, and Hillman was on his way to the best start ever in the big league. The Mets got three more runs. In the ninth inning, Jeff McKnight's single sent two Mets home, and the Mets were in front by a score of 4 nothing. Hillman went the distance for his first shutout. He hasn't given up a run in 23 innings. The Mets ended their 11-game road trip with a 6-5 record. They won today 4 to nothing.